Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say thank you for the support. I really do appreciate it. I'm trying to get 100,000 subscribers, so if you want to help me out, make sure to subscribe. Now enjoy the video. Oh, you poor soul. Freezing out here is not doing your body quite well, is it? Well then, ain't that just a shame? You know, as a demon, we don't really freeze in cold temperatures like this, or even die, as a matter of fact. You seem unwell. Oh, such a tragedy. Humans are normally out here dying on their own free will. But you're an outcast. I can sense that in you. Hmm. Oh, what awful things those humans must have done to you, to be outcast by your own people. I mean, it has to be quite utterly painful to see your own kind go against you, correct? Hmm. Oh, I have a solution. Why don't I give you some blood? They'll turn you into a demon and you'll be able to live forever. Unless, well, a demon slayer comes around and slices your head off. But that's rarely ever happened, especially if he accepts you. Why, I mean our lord and savior Muzan, of course. After all, he was the one that turned me here, and, well, I couldn't be any happier. So why don't I give you some blood? And who knows, maybe you'll turn into one of the twelve upper moons, like I am. <laughs> but before I do that, I would like to have a nice conversation with you. So, please, do tell me, what is your name? Right, I shall try to remember that. Do you hold any type of special talents that I need to know about? Oh, you're a swordsman. Well, you think you would fit in quite well with us because we only have one swordsman on our side. And that's Lord Kokoshibo. The upper one rank moon. He is quite powerful. After all, he is also a wielder of said blade. And he learned his own breathing techniques. Oh yes, Lord Kokoshibu is quite strong on his own. But with a team behind him, such as myself and the other higher-ups, we are basically unstoppable when it comes to these said demon hunters. <laughs> Don't be so foolish with yourself. 
No human in their right mind would come after us just so blatantly and out, outright blindedly. They need strategy before they can go against us. And that's why they have these so-called Hashira to deal with us. So you have heard of them? Hmm. Do you have any type of information about the Hashira? Ah, I see. So you are working with them. If I'm correct, they've kicked you out because what? You couldn't hold a sword? Or even fight against others that could be stronger than you are? Hmm. That's quite a shame, honestly. You know... As a demon, you'd get the utmost amount of strength and plus immortality. You learn how to regrow your limbs with quite an ease. That is, if you accept to become a demon. It's quite simple, really. Although the transformation could be painful to those who aren't ready for it. All I need to do is give you some blood. And then afterwards, the transformation should happen instantaneously. Your body will feel cold. And then your blood will start to boil. But after that, your body will transform itself into its proper full potential. Either that be a grotesque creature that you turn into, or even the body that you wished for for all of your life. It's just a matter of how you think you want your body to look. And whether the blood will transform you correctly. If not, if the blood, well, doesn't go with you, it will simply just turn you into a pile of mush of human flesh and bones. Because this blood is quite potent, you know. It's not one to be dealt with without caution. Now, now, there's no need to be all sorts of rowdy with me. If you want to be rowdy, I can just leave you here to die. Or you could be obedient to me and listen to the words that I'm speaking to you. Very well, very good. You're starting to learn some manners now. Well, let's see what type of manners you really have once you turn into a demon. Now, hold still so I can give you a bit of my blood. And here you go. <laughs> You will feel a rapid change happen. Your body will start to become numb. And don't worry. I know exactly what to do with you if your blood doesn't match up with the same blood that I have now coursed through your veins. All you need to do is not fight it. Become one with the demon blood, and you will become a demon yourself. Yes, yes, this is very good. The blood is going quite well with your body. You are becoming a demon. Very good, human. 
Very good. You might be a little bit hungry now, but do not worry. I know a few places where you can get nice human flesh, and they won't even notice what would happen. Now, take my hand. I shall bring you under my wing and show you the ways of a demon. <laughs>